Welcome back to DXB Today. This episode, we're talking about recycling and all of the good things that we can do to help the planet and help people. So right now, our guest is a musician, but not only a musician, he's making music with a meaning and a purpose. Please welcome to the show. Big thank you and appreciation to you, Daniel Aranda. Thanks good for having me. Good to see you, man. Thank you so much. Um, so your music, you have music with a meaning and music with a purpose. I see you lot are doing a lot of stuff in uh, Africa. Mm -hmm. so, uh, so what made you go into that kind of uh, road direction? Well, I guess it was, it was somewhat accidental, as, as most good things are, that I had a show planned in East Africa and Uganda, I think first one was 2017. Um, and uh, we plan the show, we're getting ready for it. And uh, after doing a lot more research, meeting with people, uh, visiting Uganda, that I felt somewhat of a responsibility, perhaps, or a desire to, to help uh, to, to help change to help change lives and improve uh, what can be improved. And so we did a little fundraising, did some some uh, some concerts to to raise money and uh, equipment and medical stuff for people that need it so it was that's the way it started amazing good job man thank fantastic you fantastic <laughs> job brother so yeah back to this side of the water in dubai mm. so how do you find it being here you've been here for a few years now yeah. and, and where do you play and what's going on yeah it's great i i play wherever they they want to put up with me i guess from <laughs> from, from place to place i also play uh, quite f a little more frequently abroad in Europe and uh, sometimes back home in Australia where I'm from and uh, but it's great it's hot but it's great yeah this is <laughs> it and your style of music as well you have a fantastic it tones oh thank you so where did you first like have this desire and and where did you get first get spotted oh uh, well I guess I I'd, I've always been around music my dad loves music plays guitar and I remember maybe being I don't know six or seven and hearing Elvis for the first time and that kind of opened my eyes and my ears and I've been spending 20 plus years since trying to be close to that. So, yeah. Fantastic. Well, we're looking forward to hearing you play tonight. Thank you. Really appreciate you being here. It means a Pleasure. lot to us. Cheers, man. Thanks. Take care. Now, as the region's biggest fintech summit was underway, Mafer caught up with the industry experts to find out how they're representing the latest innovations in the sector. This is the Dubai Fintech Summit. Have a look. I'm at the Dubai Fintech Summit, where innovation meets opportunity at the heart of the financial world. Come and explore with me as we go and find out what the banking and finance sector has in store for us this year. I'm here with Mr. Kartik Taneja, the Executive Vice President and Head of Payments and Consumer Lending at Mashrak Bank. How are you, Mr. Kartik? I am terrific. Thank you for having me. So Mr. Kartik, I want to say, how are you seeing the summit this year and how is it impacting the finance sector? The finance sector is having its moment in the sun, right? Uh, I think all banks are doing exceptionally well. There's a lot of interest in innovation. There's a, there's a lot of stuff happening in the industry. So as you can see, I think this, this year the conference is a lot bigger. If you look at the participation, it's a lot more. I mean, it's super crowded. We know that Denia AI is headquartered in Singapore, but can you tell us about your presence here in Dubai? Sure. I mean, like we are headquarters in Singapore, but we developed our, our communication platform in Arabic. So that's why we are here in Dubai. We love the city because it's, it's Dubai is a synonym for invention. Dubai is a synonym for, for future. So Dina should be the same. So we are here and, and also this summit is known that last year was a big event, like super kind of populated with the customers, super populated with the other competitors. So that's why we are here. We really love the bus of the conference. So we've seen so many changes in the banking sector in the last few years, but what do we expect in the future? So, um, look, banking is evolving rapidly and it's all uh, back to technology advancement, right? Uh, so we will continue to explore that. Now, today you will see a number of technologies being used to improve customer experience. Now, customers, uh, they expect these services to be instant. They expect these services to be intelligent, personalized to a great extent, right? And they expect these services to be innovative. Right, so we are working on all these three dimensions. So of course, I mean, we cannot miss the Dubai FinTech Summit. Um, we've been year after year uh, co-host actually of the summit. So we have a great presence um, in the exhibition area, but also a number of sessions in which we're participating, moderating, 
uh, being part of uh, a number of panels. Uh, fintechs are at the heart of everything that we do as Visa, and that's why there is no way that we can miss the Dubai Fintech Summit. Sure. There you have it, the Dubai Fintech Summit reminds us that technology is not the only driving force in finance, but it's human ingenuity that's shaping its evolution. So until next time, keep innovating and keep pushing the boundaries for the financial world. See you next time. Thank you to Maitha for that report. Well, it's time to wrap things up, and yes, we do have a special performance. But first, a reminder that if you want to check out any clips from the show, any of your highlights, your favorite interviews, you can check that all out on YouTube. Dubai One is on there, and we are very active. So come by, say hello, watch a few videos. <laughs> and of course, Insta is always there as well. Go onto our Instagram page. Always fun facts, and we've got prizes to give away as well. So yeah, log on. And if that ain't enough, there's a hashtag down there somewhere as well. Make sure you use that to send us all your thoughts. That's it from all the team here today. Join us again tomorrow as we commemorate motherhood with our Mother's Day special. For now, though, as promised, time to play out with a rather special performance by none other than Daniel Aranda. Good night. Same what you